Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am the FX Savant. And in this video, we have Confessions of a Trader, episode four. Episode four. In episode four, what do I want to speak about? I want to speak about a quote. A quote I heard that probably helped my trading career early on. I'm sure a lot of people were, are like this or were like this. And the quote is, if you trade to learn, you will learn to trade. Yes, I know cliche, simple it sounds, but you'd be surprised of what you can actually get from this quote. If you trade to learn, that means you're not worried about the profits. You're not worried about how much you're making. You're not worried about what you look like to other people on social media, to everyone else. You're simply solely trading only to learn the skill. So this may be opening a demo account and using only 0.001 lots not even a mini lot or a standard lot. You might only be trading uh, micro lots. So you open trades with no intention or you're not even worried about the profits. You're not worried about what the numbers are. You're simply solely trading to only learn the skill. Now, why is this? Why do you want to trade to learn? Because in turn, you will learn to trade. If you are constantly trying to chase profits or I want to make such and such amount of money in a day or I want to make this amount of money to quit my job or I want to make this because I can buy this with it, you won't do the necessary steps that you need to to actually become a successful trader, to do it the right way, to gain the discipline. You won't have that because you'll be chasing a monetary value. You'll break your plan. You'll trade outside of your trading hours. You'll trade outside of your rules. You'll do all these other types of things because you're not solely trading to learn how to trade you're trading what you have learned in order to amass what you want so you may have spent months and months and months or hours and weeks and days and years learning uh, your certain strategy or just learning about the market support resistance structure uh, indicators fundamentals you may spend all this time learning about those but you're not actually learning how to trade you're learning about trading so not until you actually do the act the correct way will you learn how to trade quote you've probably heard is you can't learn how to do a push-up by reading it in a book you have to actually do it yes you can prepare you can do all all the techniques and everything the exact way perfect form and how to do it but you will not know how to do a push-up until you actually do it and no one who has never done a push-up will start doing push-ups to try to gain muscle uh, in the next week it just doesn't work like that you know it doesn't work like that you're gonna have to put in the time and actually learn to build the muscles your pecs biceps a little bit of your back whatever you're using to do your push-ups you will have to learn how to do a push-up in order to get the results you want same way with trading you need to learn how how to trade then you need to experience it for education not for whatever it is you want you need to learn the skill so you know what you're doing and then another quote or saying that I will put out there is that you will not make money or you will not be become let me say it like that you will not become successful in trading until you don't need to be successful in trading let me break that down. So you want to be a full-time trader or a successful trader or whatever success is for you. You want that immediately. You want that right now. And since you want that so bad, it's gonna run from you. You're not gonna reach it. Same way as um, I said before, you're gonna break your rules. You're gonna do all these other types of things that you shouldn't do because you want something so bad. Instead, if you take the time, have patience, and actually learn the skill, you will get whatever you want. Once you understand how to trade, the money is infinite. People will give you money because you know how to make money, not trying to make money or wanting to make money. Oh, well, uh, if I just had this amount of money, if you just loaned me such and such, such and such, a certain amount, um, I could turn that into whatever, whatever, and we both could be good. But if you don't know how to actually do that, then you're just gonna burn that bridge. That could be a potential investor that would love to throw money at you later once you actually know the skill. That's why I think these prop firm challenges are very valuable because you can actually go through these challenges with demo accounts, with no money uh, invested into the company, any company you wanna choose, you can do it as many times as you want over and over and over until you actually get the skill down, which is a way to prove that you actually trade. Each challenge or each company, each prop firm that's out there right now, you got your FTMOs, the Godfather, you got your My Forex Funds, who's right behind them, you got the prop traders, you have, who else? The Fivers, it's 
plenty out there. None of these people were giving me any any money to say their name. So uh, yeah, it's not sponsored or anything, but all these people, all these companies have challenges or evaluations or some sort of system in place for you to actually get funded. So they will give you money. Now you have to go through certain criteria and rules to obtain that money, to obtain that capital. But once you do, it's yours. So keep that in mind. It's a lot. It makes more sense to actually purchase one of these proprietary prop trading firms challenges to get a larger amount of capital to trade rather than using your own capital to trade because trading is all about percentages profits the more money you have the more money you make and if you actually know what you're doing you can get as much money as you want fairly quickly so if you prove that you can trade once you actually know how to trade the money will come but not until you actually take the time to sit down and learn the actual skill so you need to learn to don't go in the market trying to become a millionaire in one day go into the market actually trying to study and learn how the market moves and then through that learning you will get some data record some data you will notice some things that happen over and over and over again you'll write them down you'll put them down you'll make a note and you'll actually start to remember the things that you did well that profited you and then you'll remember the things that you didn't do well that affected you negatively in your trading and you will learn over time through mistakes and losing money that you will learn over time how to trade correctly if you actually take the time to learn to trade so don't rush don't run for the money don't think someone else is making a thousand dollars a day i need to be making a thousand dollars a day no you need to be learning how to trade for yourself and once you do you will make a thousand dollars a day when it's ready for you so don't rush it if you run after it if you chase it it'll run from you but if you become a successful trader and attract good trades, good success, it will come to you. So don't go out there running for the money, learn the skill and people will throw money at you. You can quickly, quickly, it wouldn't take long. So once you learn how to trade, I say that you can change your life within a month and that's, uh, that's about average. So once you learn how to trade, actually learn the skill, you understand that you're profitable, you can do it consistently the same way, day in, day out, week in, week out, month in, month out, year in, year out. It becomes routine and you can see the results not you just made a bunch of money in a few trades now you have some money and you really don't know what you did but once you actually get to the point to where you understand you're trading yourself do everything you're not chasing after the monetary value not chasing the market you're actually trading your setups doing things the right way cutting your losses early if that's part of your plan and just not breaking your rules you will soon become a successful trader and you will see opportunities that are coming out of nowhere and people want you to help them to trade for them to trade their money but you will have plenty of opportunities to make money once you learn the skill so yeah that's pretty much it nice confessions of a trader anything else don't worry about money trade to learn and you will learn to trade you will make money when you don't need to make money in the market that's a big one you will make the money when you don't need to make the money so if you are able to support yourself through some other sorts of means while you're learning to trade if you continue to do that and not want to take your trading and make that be your income right away you will soon have your trading income take over your whatever it is income and then you can think about switching like that but yeah when you don't need the money when you're stressing putting five hundred dollars into an account because it's your last five hundred dollars and you're risking 250 on a trade and you're got two uh you're, you got a hedge position on one trade and it's two lots and it's just crazy and you're just rushing to make the money instead of saying hey i could use this 500 dollars. i could buy a course i could learn i could study i could do some back testing and then i can actually learn how to do how to trade a 500 dollars the correct way to where you won't lose it and then you'll look up and you'll see that you are getting five hundred thousand dollar account getting to you taking your $500, done a little challenge, proved to them you could do it. A couple times over, amassed a few hundred thousand dollars in capital to trade for yourself. And there you go. Your life has changed within a month or two after you've learned how to trade. And that's up to you on how long it takes. But I say get you a good mentor, someone who's really passionate about teaching the markets and wanting other people to succeed. Me, myself, I feel I'm like that. So if you think I'm a good fit for you, I'll let me. But other than that, learn the skill. Nobody cares about what you post. Nobody cares about how much money you make. So do it for yourself. Don't do it for anyone else. And you'll be where you want to be pretty soon. But other than that, hope you have a profitable day on and off the charts. Until next time, I holler.